Embrace what? what? What does New Mexico State do again, David? I forget. Embrace the... Embrace the struggle. <laughs> Embrace <laughs> Almost the butchered it again. Beat down. <laughs> so Texas opens up. They want to go up tempo, get some plays, get some scores on third and six. That's why they call them magic, but this is a small boo-boo. Coughs it up. That's a fumble. New Mexico State recovers. Texas fantastic controlling the football a season ago. Only lost five fumbles tied for the six viewers in the ball subdivision. Well, yeah. he was just too loose with that thing right there. You got to keep it closer to your body. Major Alpwhite is going to be working on that heavily come this week in practice. Texas trying to come back fourth and two and Jonathan Gray stuffed in the wild. That hardly ever happens. Yeah, they did a good job up front. You know, fourth and two, everyone knows they're running the ball, and they beat our offensive line and made a good play. But the defense, they would manage to make plays when they would need to. Fourth Boom. and one, New Mexico State. Yeah, I tell you, Lowell, it's, it's amazing how how much it's helped Texas defense practicing against up to up to the offense with Texas because they flew around and they were swarming the ball all night long. They ran 45 plays in the first half, and they still never looked tired. Got to be too deep. Second string defensive end, Reggie Wilson. That's a senior play right there, Mark Brooks. Well, what I love about it, watch him chase down. He missed the play, but he came up. He didn't give yeah. up. We weren't seeing those types of plays a year ago. Excellent job by Reggie Wilson, and he deserved to get the, the, the call fumble there. Texas with the rock. Second quarter, no score. Major talked about this. Oh. He said that they made a better call than I made. And like he said, they checked, and when they checked, Tex, uh the other Aggies check. I'm trying to yeah, all, all yeah. this checking going Don't talk on. Talk about those Aggies. Yeah, New Mexico State. So yeah, it, it was a bad throw. He threw it like it was three deep, and it was really two deep. He got the pick. And costly because those are and there's drives nothing. that could go into the end zone. As a former quarterback, I hate this. They ought to take this and not call it an interception when <laughs> oh, it's bad. Oh come on, like that. former <laughs> low. Let me tell you yeah. something. Look, look right here. It should have been a touchdown with that. D lineman just stuck his <laughs> hand up. Hey, Ricky, what did you say in the pregame show? <laughs> no excuses. excuses. No, excuses. No, no, excuses. no, that's wrong. <laughs> David Ash, third and five, and New Mexico State. Those Aggies, the ones from Las Cruces, they get on the scoreboard first. Yeah. Andrew Andrew well, McDonald with the touchdown toss to Joshua a, Bowen. It's a well-thrown ball, but I'd like to see Michael Thompson there when you hug that wide receiver, turn around and get a batted down pass. Two minutes left, and there's your spark. John Harris, oh, I'm slippery getting to the inside. He That's the whole shot you need in two deep right there. That was the one he was missing to Mike Davis, uh, the, the drive before. That was a great throw, great catch, great run after catch as well. The cool. one highlight we're missing was the kicker turn. Dalton <laughs> Santos. <laughs> a full head of steam. That was the spark, and then this is the first time they find the end zone. John Harris, one of those guys waiting to break out, had a touchdown in junk time against Oklahoma a year ago. That's his first real meaningful touchdown catch in a Texas uniform. DeJay Johnson, you're not going to touch that. Get yeah. used to seeing that number wow. four get smaller and smaller off into the distance. Now, there's an, there's an exciting feeling you get when you watch a player like this because you know every time he touches the ball, he's got a chance to take it all the way. And I look forward to seeing him touch the ball a whole lot more this year. And when it's three deep like that, one safety in the middle, the weakness is right down the middle of the field in those seams. And he, he found it. it. Yep, he found it. 66-yard touchdown. Oh, that was quick. Back-to-back -back throws. And David Ash makes it 14 points. New Mexico State opens up the second half. They think they have recovered this onside kick. The Jarrett Elliott lookalike, Doug Martin, says, I thought we had it, but they don't. And this is a pod formation. This is what Texas fans will love. You got three backs there. Jonathan Gray, the lead blocker for the Jay Johnson, and it works. He does a great job, you know. Cuts the defensive back, creates a seam, and DJ takes it, takes it all the way. And Lola, it's been great blocking on the perimeter all night long. You, you saw Jonathan Gray back there make that block. Shipley blocked unbelievable tonight as well. Adrian Phillips, was it an interception? Money maker, they baby. at this one. And DBU, yeah, they can say, they're spinning the big bills. Oh, I like how he hugged that play there. He saw that coming. You could tell with the, with the way that his eyes work. David Ash. Look at him go. Major Applewhite says, different quarterback, Ooh, he uses Shipley. the legs. Yeah, look at Shipley blocking. That play would have never happened if Shipley didn't, one, if he wasn't being so unself. Absolutely. Make a great play. Career long, 55 yard touchdown for David Ash, close to 100 yards rushing for number one four. Completely different team, different momentum at this point when it looks like everything is just rolling in their favor. And it didn't just look that oh. way, it was. Malcolm Brown, oh, get the guy out on the sideline. He got some more blocking down the field, and Malcolm Brown, 74 yards. That's his career-long reception. 
That one goes for the touchdown. You know what I liked about this play is pre-snap, they moved him to the, to the boundary side because they saw that blitz coming, and they knew the Aggies' defense couldn't cover it. Excellent game planning either by Ash or Major. Cedric Reed was a beast among those. Yes, yeah, he was. He was all over the field tonight. At one point, I knew he had eight tackles, but this young man played a heck of a ball game and proved the reason why he won that starting job. TFL tackles for loss. Woo! Son Ridgeway. Get high, big boy. Give me all of those. Does that count for two tackles in the books? Hey, he's a big fella. I'll give him two tackles if that's what he wants. I ain't going to contest that. One pump, two Ooh. pump. David Ash, he's got Mike Davis. Mike Davis got the ball and Man. one foot in the pay dirt, Ricky Williams. That's another thing. You know, it's one of the most difficult things is when you start off slow, you have a couple drops, you have a fumble. It's hard to get your head back in the game. To make a play like that, you have to have your head in the game. Yeah, great awareness right there. Jalen Overstreet then gets his chance. This is when they start to slow it down. And Ricky, this is what you started talking about. Four running backs now that really get to oh, split the pill for Texas. Yeah, and with the talent this Texas team has, especially on offense, they should be able to dominate no matter who they play. They can throw the ball, they can run the ball, they can do it all. And I think that's what Major's talking about when he talks about balance.